Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do something a little different than I normally do. Um, my husband Jim and I have been wanting backyard sheds to use as offices slash workout rooms slash you know creative spaces so we went into the Home Depot's website and we found tough sheds and we decided to purchase two 10 by 20 sheds and um, I thought I would record the process of getting them bare bones and then turning them into you know our own personal visions so yeah let's get started So the first thing we needed to do was prep the ground for our sheds. Um, so first thing we did was take out some of the grass and then we had some gravel delivered to the house and we rented a skip loader and transferred the gravel over to the areas. Um, and then we smoothed that out, smoothed the gravel out and then we compacted it. So the day finally came when the sheds arrived and uh, you know they come in pieces and the workers put them all together for you and you know the, the shingles and the windows and the doors and um, yeah they did a great job and they, it came unpainted of course and then we took over from there. So we first started on the wiring. had to prep all the wires for all the canned lighting on the ceilings and then all you know all the outlets and then also for the ceiling fan. I am going to install a fake window okay. for this air conditioner. Oh. It's going to go right there. Okay. This way. Nice. And then once he got the air conditioner in, he started on all the insulation. Late night working on the shed. Let's see what's going on in here.
insulation on the ceiling, but then he decided to go ahead and use this uh, foam board insulation. So then he had to make holes in the insulation foam boards and the drywall for the wiring. So after we taped and plastered the seams, we used this product here to prime the drywall before we painted. So this is the paneling and the pergo flooring that we chose for his shed.
up the page and finish this thing. Damn it. It's hard to see the color that he chose, but it is a real pretty taupe. And last but not least for the inside, the finishing touch is this ceiling fan. So now that I know I can roll it around and it folds up, it folds up into something that big. You can spin it around. You can see the other side. So you got your dresser, your TV, your desk. So there we go, we got the inside of the shed done, we got the deck done, it came out so beautiful. Um, we are going to eventually decorate the inside, but that will have to be in another video because this one is so long. I hope that you will subscribe and follow along with our progress. And like I said, eventually we'll be doing my shed as well. So um, yeah, we got lots to look forward to. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope that you will um, subscribe. Until next time, bye friends.